Hi, this is uh, Kirk Kasanowski from Hospice Advisors. Happy holiday. Our weekly case study this week deals with a hospital that, or hospice, excuse me, a hospice that was trying to break into a hospital. The presenting issue and challenge was they really didn't have a set strategy and truly know how to bring value to the hospital. So we ended up working together trying to determine what would be the best thing that the hospice could do to bring value to the hospital. And we started off by looking at uh, understanding the hospital. First seek to understand before you seek to be understood. And we looked at the uh, www.ahd.com website. And it's a great website to give you a free profile on the hospital. Second, we looked at and spoke with our medical director who had privileges at the hospital. We understood that the hospital was really challenged with lowering its uh, mortality length of stay and its readmissions. Nothing new for hospitals nowadays. So what we did is in this hospice had a GIP contract in place with the hospital but never utilized it. Long and short of it, we developed a GIP scatter bed program for the hospital and that involved you know, contracting with two hospitalists in the hospital to sort of be our docs to see our patients there structured an education program throughout the hospital with a big focus on the emergency department so that those folks would not be readmitted. And we utilized the GIP contract and built a GIP scatter bed program and put that into place. The results were this. One, it really did help lower the uh, mortality stats for the hospital, the readmission rates, and more importantly drove uh, about six to eight referrals a month from the hospital, uh, uh, two to three of them were GIP, but as the hospital became um, comfortable with the hospice, they started utilizing that hospice as its preferred provider. So long and short of it, this case study showed that coming in with value, the GIP component, helping the hospital reduce its readmission rate, uh, lower its mortality length of stay, helped establish a, a, a nice preferred relationship with that hospice. So with that, I'll say take care and have a marvelous holiday season. Take care, bye-bye, thank you.